Hey guys, it's just I here today, and today I'm going to be showing you all my Lego Star Wars Jedi Starfighter with hyperdrive wing. I actually built a hyperdrive ring for the Jedi Starfighter. So the Jedi Starfighter is actually in the hyperdrive ring. Um, fits perfectly. Um, so let me take the um thing off. Uh, let me take the actual Jedi Starfighter off so I could show you the actual hyperdriver ring. Um, see these flaps? Gotta take off. Lift these flaps. And yeah, the Jedi Starfighter. There. You see how there's this pink thing on the bottom? Well, the reason there's like a space right here is. For the pink thing to go in and there are um three studs that the jazz starfighter can land on and then you lift down these these flaps from a jedi interceptor i actually got but i got broken <laughs> of course um and then you could jump to hyperspace now i actually gotta fix something um and and a piece to the engine fell off and the whole engine fell off. Now this whole ring. This isn't really much of a ring. It's more of half a ring. But I still like it. Because I thought. Because I've never built a hyperdrive ring. And I thought that my Jedi Starfighter needs a hyper. Oh, God, that fell off. And I thought that my Jedi Starfighter needed a hyperdrive ring. To jump to hyperspace on. So. Yeah. Um. So this is what the hyperdrive ring looks like. You can put the flaps down if you want, but um, I just like to keep them like this. So that way when the Jedi Starfighter lands, um, the flaps can fold down. So that, so that way um, when the Jedi Starfighter lands, lands on it, um, before it lands, the flaps won't have to come back up. So, yeah, the the um, engines they're on hinges. They're on hinges. Um, the engines there the are these things, the hyperdrive engines, and then yeah. So, I'm also going to be showing you guys the my Republic, my own Republic gunship I built myself. Um, let me move this out the way. Um, so, yeah. Um, let me take the minifigures out. Um, one second. I forget if I sh showed you this last video, um, but I really don't care. <laughs> I just wanted to get, like, a full in- oh, see that. Plating is coming off the inside. Um, I just really wanted to show you, sorry about that, plating is coming off on the inside. I just really wanted to show you this, like the full thing, full interior. So let's show you it. Um, so, if you take this, this is the cockpit, but you can take the cockpit off, such so it, it could be like an escape pod for the pilot. Um, let me take this off. You can take this GI interceptor piece windshield off and then here's your pilot control panel here's your pilot and here is your control panel so yeah then you can put the windshield cockpit windshield piece back on yeah <laughs> um anyways um so the doors can actually open. They're on um, hinges too. They're on um, Technic hinges. They're on like uh, Technic pins. The Technic hinge pins. The Technic pins, whatever you want to call them. They're actually on that. Um, I forget what you call these things. Like the things that they're actually. But. Technically, ha half of this Republic gunship and half of the Jedi, half of the stuff I'm making, 
is literally just plates. Like, the, half of this is plates. Almost all of this is plates. Like, there, there's literally no bricks in this one. They're literally, like, all plates. Like, there are, like, few small bricks in that one. And then, there's, like, a whole, yes, there's a whole wall of bricks. Probably made up of about 10 to 20, 15 to 20 bricks. Like, and this is all, um, plating, so. But anyways, yeah, you can open the doors and you can land on whatever planet you want to land on. You can pretend whatever planet it is. Could be Geonosis, could be Camino, could be Mustafar. Um, you name it. Um, and then I built my own custom Galactic Marines. Not the ones from Episode 3. But um, you can put them in the gunship. And then you could put this Geonosis Trooper I rebuilt. I put, I rebuilt a new Geonosis Trooper. So, yeah. You can put him in. Close it up. And fly off to whichever planet you want to fly off. <laughs> so, yeah, guys. Um, that was a review of my Jedi Starfighter hy Hyperdrive Ring. Put it back on. And the Republic gunship. I really hope you guys enjoyed the video. I really hope you guys enjoyed my hyperdrive ring. I hope you guys enjoyed my Jazz Starfighter video review. Um, that's a different video. Um, Y'all can go check that out on my channel. Um, don't forget to su like and subscribe, and I hope you guys liked this, my custom Republic gunship I built myself, cause I, cause I really want an actual Republic gunship, but I never got one, um, so yeah, I might ask for it for Christmas or something, though, but, anyways, I will see y'all next time, bye, alright.